Hey, Dan Mervish here, and if you're like me and you just got back from Sundance and all you have is a cold to show for it, maybe a little bit of swag, uh, one of the things you may have picked up while you were there is some of these cardboard uh, Google Glass thingies, which, uh, which you can also buy for like two bucks from Google or something like that, which is their kind of crazy cardboard hack against the... Uh, the virtual reality Oculus Rift Prime people, whatever. Uh, anyway, but one of the cool things you can do with it is, because uh, if you're like me, the whole virtual reality thing just kind of gives you a, an aneurysm. Uh, but what you can do is you can actually, see those lenses in there? You can actually take one out, or if you want, just use the one that comes with it and don't do anything. You just gotta take this thing apart here, like so, you take this out, like so, you kind of re, deconstruct it like that see and then you got your uh, your little DSLR from Canon or whoever else you got and you just sort of take it apart take the lens off like this and I don't know if Google realized this but they weren't just giving away free virtual reality they were actually giving away a free 35 millimeter lens because all you do is you do that and because of the way the focal lengths are, it actually works as a pretty awesome cheap lens. And if you really want to get fancy, you can take one of the lenses and uh, stick it on a piece of cardboard, take, cut it, tape it up, cut it out, and give it to you. Here is what this lens looks like. Look at this cool lens. Whoa! Cheapest lens ever. We are recording outside the neighborhood here, doing some tilty shifty stuff here. Some nice flares going on, moving, moving it with my hand a little bit here. And there you go. Of course, if you're not some artsy fartsy Sundance director, then just get a piece of construction paper, stick a hole in it like so and just pop it over your lens like so. Just like that, and this is what we get. And here we are with the pinhole adapter. Pretty awesome looking. But wait, there's more. It also makes a nifty little macro lens for your iPhone. Wow.